Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuvir. In this class, we will discuss about mean and variance of a Poisson's distribution. In our previous class, we clearly discussed about mean and variance of binomial distribution. The mathematics is very, very similar to that. Please watch that class and come back here. The link for the playlist is provided in the description below. Coming to today's class. So the probability mass function of a Poisson's distribution is e power minus lambda lambda power x by x factorial that is given as f of x. We call this function as f of x. So we call it mean mu or expected value. Everything is same mean or mu or expected value is given as mu is given as a mean value is given as sigma all x x f of x. So the probability mass function, this is how we find the uh, mean value for the expected value for the discrete probability distributions. Uh, this, this concept we already discussed when in the beginning of uh, discrete probability distributions. Uh, so this is how we find that. Uh, now if you substitute probability mass function here, sigma x is equal to 0 to infinite. Uh, in Poisson's distribution, we are having infinite values. Uh, x is equal to 0 to infinite x e power minus lambda lambda power x by x factorial so this is the probability mass function if you if you take out the e power minus lambda outside and if you substitute x is equal to 0 here the entire term will become 0 so that's why no need to place the uh, x is equal to 0 term here in the Poisson's distribution so that's why we are taking it from x is equal to 1 to infinite e power minus lambda if you take it out e power minus lambda sigma x is equal to 1 to infinite lambda power x by x minus 1 factorial how we got this x minus 1 factorial if you write it as x factorial x x minus 1 x minus 2 so on 1 x will be cancelled with this x so that's why x minus 1 factorial remain in the denominator so x minus 1 factorial lambda power x by x minus 1 factorial if you take lambda out from here 1 lambda lambda power x means if you take out 1 lambda lambda power n x minus 1 remains so lambda power x minus 1 by x minus 1 factorial outside will get lambda e power minus lambda sigma x is equal to 1 to infinite this term this term this is the expansion of e power x expansion in place of x we are having a e lambda expansion e power lambda so that's why lambda power x minus 1 by x minus 1 this is the e power x expansion from the plus 1 plus 2 mathematics if you don't know what's e power x expansion please take our mathematical course plus 1 plus 2 course and then come back here now coming to that in place of this we replace with e power lambda so lambda e power minus lambda e power lambda lambda e power minus lambda e power lambda cancelled so we'll remain with lambda so finally expected value mean value is given as lambda similarly we have to identify the variance of the Poisson's distribution variance sigma square is given as a variance value we for the discrete random variables we identify using this equation expected of x square minus expected of x whole square we already identified expected of x what is the expected of x value lambda so means lambda square otherwise we write it as mu square so expected of x square can be written as sigma all x x square f of x minus expected of x whole square is given as mu square so we already know mu square mu means lambda here uh, we have to identify this term so now we are going to identify these terms so sigma x is equal to 0 to infinite x square e power minus lambda lambda power x by x factorial x square can be written as x x minus 1 plus 1 means x square minus x plus x which is x square so instead of writing x square we are writing it like this so you can divide it now you can separate this term and you can separate this term that's why we have written it so e power minus lambda from from here e power minus lambda has been taken out sigma x is equal to see here if you substitute x is equal to 0 this entire term will be 0 okay x is equal to 0 means 0 if you substitute x is equal to 1 this entire term will become 0 that's why we are writing it as a so no need to write x is equal to 0 and 1 we are starting from x is equal to 2 to infinite if you take e power minus lambda outside e power minus lambda sigma x is equal to 2 to infinite 
if you want to cancel this x x minus 1 divided by x factorial lambda power x the, this term is taken as one term and this x is taken as another term x is equal to 0 to infinite lambda power x e power minus lambda by x factorial this is what we call it as a mean value this is how we this is the equation to find the mean value so in place of this we can place it as what is the mean of Poisson's distribution lambda lambda is placed here so this can be written as e power minus lambda see x x minus 1 if you take the x factorial x factorial can be written as x x minus 1 x minus 2 so on x x minus 1 will be cancelled out so what's remain in the denominator x minus 2 factorial if you take lambda square outside what is remain here lambda power x minus 2 that is what we write here e power minus lambda lambda square is taken out sigma x is equal to 2 to infinite lambda power x minus 2 by x minus 2 factorial this is the expansion of e power x so in place of this we can write it as e power lambda so that's why e power minus lambda lambda square e power lambda plus lambda so e power minus lambda lambda cancelled lambda square plus lambda this is what the expansion of e expected of x square so finally variance means expected of x square is lambda square plus lambda so variance is lambda square plus lambda minus lambda square so if you cancel out finally remind sigma square is equal to lambda so the variance of the Poisson's distribution is lambda and the mean value for the Poisson's distribution is lambda so this is this I hope you understand the der derivation for the mean and uh, variance of Poisson's distribution if you have any questions regarding the concept please post two questions in the comment section below thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates thank you